What's up you guys? Commander Boomer here, welcoming you back to another exciting episode of XCOM Enemy Within. Last episode we just got back from a covert operation, which it seems to be getting easier and easier because Exalta has not been upgrading their weapons. And we got a lot of things coming up here in uh, just a few minutes. We got that coming up, we got a council report coming up. As far as I can tell, everyone is doing okay. Some governments are not that great, but they're not going to leave. So, with that, we're going to get this show on the road. Okay, we've got Archangel armor. Yay! Arch Archangel armor. Advanced flight project available in the foundry. All right, we're gonna go with the uh, outsider shard. Incoming transmission. Excellent work, Commander. This council is pleased to see our continued support of this project has been worthwhile. We hope that your current successes only mark the beginning of an enduring effort to eliminate the extraterrestrial threat. Okay, we got a B in this one because the <clears throat> excuse me, uh, the UFO escaped. Remember, we will be watching. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Yep, and we get to upgrade our mechs here. This is uh, who's this is? This is um. Ah, Martine. She's gonna get the proximity mines. A hundred. Oh God. A <laughs> hundred meld. A hundred and four credits. Good God. Proximity mines. Oh wow, that looks beastly. Compared to Mark, there's Mark two. Oh, dude, look at that. Look how much it changed. Wow. Alright, and he will get the Electro Pulse. Alright. Advanced flight. Three. Ooh, 325 credits. Ouch. Do we need to build any facilities right now? Not at present. No. Um, I'm trying to think of what else. Uh, oh, yeah. Upgrade. Max weapons. That's 450 credits right there. Sure, there's nothing we could do in the foundry. Nothing right now. No. I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. I've already put the new recruits to work in the lab. 51 scientists now. Alright. Eagle over these coordinates. Recon satellite Delta 2 is just coming into line of sight now, sir. Coming on screen. Nothing. No, that's impossible. I know it's there. Switch to thermal. Hello. 
Give me subsurface. Gotcha. Reestablish comms with all available ground. Think of what we might find once we get inside that facility. Imagine what they might be doing down there. I'm sure we'll find out soon enough. Okay, we found it. Now how do we get inside? I thought you'd never ask. That's our short research complete. The methods involved in creating these crystals. An organic machine capable of complex communications. We could spend years studying this technology. Had to build a skeleton key. We don't have much things left to research here. <laughs> um, go with skeleton suit. I can only imagine what the aliens might be doing in an underground facility. I've got a hunch as to how we might get into that facility. Just give the word, and I'll begin manufacturing the key immediately. Give me an improved art thrower. We're certainly keeping the boys down in the foundry busy. I'll let them know you've got another project ready for production. We're gonna wait to, to assault our base. Alien base assault, so I can actually go at any time. Commander, we can begin working on a way to access the alien base as soon as you give the word. It's in Europe? Hmm. Well, I guess that figures, you know, the UK decided to go away and, you know, that's what happens. They build a base. <laughs> we'll be going shortly. Let's see. Exalt. Time lost, three days. Total time loss is three days. Okay. There must be some way to get into that base. I wonder what Dr. Shen has in mind. Probably for the next episode, it is going to be a crasher. Meaning, I'm probably going to take out the Exalt base, and, and the Exalt HQ, and the alien base. I might do those either in uh, all in one episode, but I'm gonna try to spread it out to two episodes. One assault, one episode is the assault on. I remember when all we heard about were flying saucers? The aliens certainly have come a long way. The exalt HQ, and the other and the other episode will be on the alien base. All right, send Covert out. XCOM operative deployed against Exalt Cell in Germany. Oh, it's in Germany, so it'll help lower their panic level. Everyone should be fitted. I'll change out the loadout. Six, eight, ten, eleven, thirteen. 9, 11, 10, 15, 17. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that thing looks like a freaking cannon. It probably is a cannon. It is a cannon. Duh. <laughs> Alright, he's... He's outfitted. Making sure all my guys are outfitted. Raid weapon. I do have a light plasma rifle, so I go through my substitutes here. I think the uh, yes, Viking. I got a light plasma rifle. But 
Everyone should be, yep, everyone is outfitted. Yeah, after a certain point, uh, yeah, that it usually becomes the norm, having just carapace armor. It's just like in the old XCOM UFO defense. Once you have enough materials to make personnel armor, it doesn't matter if you're a rookie, or, I mean, it doesn't matter if you're a rookie or not, you have personnel armor. Even though in most cases, the personnel armor doesn't really protect you, most of the, most of the time you still die. Contact detected. A supply barge, huh? I only have one in that area. We have eyes on the bandit. I can dodge if necessary. Defense matrix. Oops. Oh well. Yeah, those the next two episodes. Then, yeah, I'm probably gonna do them after this episode. The next two episodes are gonna be the assaults on everybody. So, <laughs> XCOM is taking the offensive, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> we are taking the offensive. We are gonna we're gonna show these people who's boss around here. to South Africa for this one, and we need to get down there fast. The UFO came down in a sparsely populated area away from any major population centers. We can secure the site with limited danger to the civilians in the area. Although, we have been taking the offensive quite, uh, recently. Sky. Strike one is free to engage hostile targets at the crash site. On the moon. They even sound like a force to be reckoned with. Oh my god, look how much health they have. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 28. They both have 28 health. Jeez. <laughs> That's affirmative. Both move fast. this thing. Zang has 28 health. He has as much health as the mechs do. <laughs> oh my god. There's so much health. Position confirmed. Hey, Vandal. Yes, sir. Move out over here. on board. I've got a visual. Ah. 
Ninety-two percent. Seventy-two and eighty-five. <laughs> 17 uh, uh he's dead okay Seventy, sixty-three. um the aliens are not gonna live very long Keeps going like this, they're not gonna live. Got it, move it. Alright, keep keep up with them. See, he has twenty-two. He has twenty-two. Twenty-two. All the other guys have twenty-two. Running. Affirmative. Moving out. Yeah, you can say we're pretty much just sticking together. Stepping off. Your move, Mr. Floater. Alien contacts are withdrawing. Armor has not been penetrated. Seven, huh? Okay. Seventy-two. <laughs> wow, I mean, thing has to power up for us to shoot. I like it. <laughs> All right. Um, let's get combo up here. Cover position here. He's the only one to hurt, so. Welcome. Let's get combo up here, patch him up. Come on, time to cowboy up. Then we'll get you to. Moving on target. Up here. Contact. Okay. See one outright, and another one by squad side. Okay, you took out the greatest threat. That's double. That's uh, double tap. Let's hit him with a regular shot. Okay, he did nine. Run him down. Rolling out. Seventy five percent. Got him down. Okay, good work. Okay, I got two mail trails. Alright, maybe we're probably gonna have to split up here. I don't like doing that, but, um,. Move up. I think you just saw something. I'm on it, Commander. Eyes on target. All right, got Mouton elites. And they're behind cover. Boy, 
What cover? Target locked. <laughs> what cover? 63, 63, 63. Why 63? They have that much armor on them? Roger, one in the center. And I still have them in the distortion field. Alright. You're gonna wait here. Just because I don't want him to use a grenade. Oh. Launch proximity mine. Proximity mine. It's way too much health for any other damage. So I'm risking a grenade. Did, did you see that? They teleported. They teleported. You see that? Ain't damage to Mr. Berserker. Ah, he ran away. Interesting little tactic. Okay. What's the status over here? Okay, yeah, he only took five damage from that melee attack. Okay, I see three. Sniper sees three. I'm not going to use my sniper to take out a drone. Does... Do you have... No, you don't. You're immune to critical hits. Disabling shot on him. Take a chill pill. Take a chill pill. I affirmative. And you couldn't fire. Okay. Okay, now. Thing. I need you to fire a shredder rocket right here. Launching. Fifty-two 
percent. See, uh, aim is because enemy's armor. Oh, let's see, I have a cluster bomb, cannon fire, and reinforced armor. So, and he's immune to critical hits, pretty much. I only have a 10% chance because of the weapon. Commence firing. Okay, I did five. Okay, where'd that berserker go? Moving. Oh, right there. Hi. Okay, my sniper has another shot. Try to hit him with a headshot. 75% chance to crit. Did 13. On my way. Missed. How did you miss? I'm on the moon. Alien material spotted. Well, I'm definitely not gonna be getting that one. One turn to go. Take him out, please. Wow, he actually took down that sector pod with pretty good ease, but that's that's good teamwork though. But did you see? I launched a proximity mine right here, or right there it is, right there, and they were right there, and then they appeared right here. See, that bug is still in place. All right, go find that other melt generator. In sight. Five turns. Where is it? Right there. Okay. Back online. Okay. Good to go. Prototype in the group in the in Zhang and combo will head forward. Moving to designated coordinates. As you wish. Yep, there's still that Mouton Elite that ran away back over here somewhere. We'll find them. Okay, you can't run that far. Yes, sir. I figured they wouldn't uh, hurt my guys, their friend foe. Oh, this is the entrance. And of course, we destroyed all the cover, so there's nothing here. <laughs> I am moving. Affirmative. Man, this ship is like on fire. <laughs> I'm on it, Commander. Drawing out the old pistols. Affirmative. Moving out. 
Well, this alien can't hide forever, can't run forever. Catch up to him eventually. Moving out. Like right now. Hi. How's it going? Target has been neutralized. So the rest of the aliens are this way. On the move. Now let's play catch up with these guys. On the move. Canister secured. All right. Got it. Moving. Jump down and jump. Up. Give his legs a good workout. Yep. Now we gotta start running back the way we came. Roger, Dodger. I'll move like the wind. Stepping off. Uh huh. Psh, you hear that? Oh, uh, we're on our way. As fast as we can get there. Heading out. She's catching up pretty quick. On my way. Standing by. Already there. Yep, I figured the side door was over there. On the move. Still got a good ways to go. I am moving. They're moving as quick as they can. Got it. Moving. Up. Let's wait for everyone else to get into position here. Already there. Actually, we probably have enough people to go ahead and assault this out. room on the next turn. These guys will still move up, but we're going to go ahead and assault. Affirmative. Moving out. Standing by. I don't think we're alone out here. Proceed. Target acquired. Hey guys, how's it going? You didn't see this coming. An 
Another one down. Good work, Commander. Let's see, we had a couple couple of minor wounds in that one. Troops are making it look easy out there. Let's hope they don't get too cocky. <laughs> it's a little late for that. Uh, I mean, he's right though, but I'm just I, I'm just mowing them all down. All right, we got a covered operation in four days, an improved art thrower in nine days. I'm waiting. Uh, also, I'm waiting for the improved art thrower. Also, so that was South Africa. Yep, they're back down to one. Skeleton suit. We're running out of things to research here. do that um, see I can come I can go ahead and make it hundred fifty four credits to produce oh I can make a firestorm how many bases do I have one, two, three, four, five. Five bases. I also need plasma cannons. Make sure we'll wait. We're gonna wait on the firestorms for now. An extraction squad. We are confident that you will handle this matter with discretion. All right, Exalt. This is one of your last chances to upgrade your technologies to plasma weapons because I am coming for you very soon. Exalt cell operating inside the German border. We'll need Strike One to rendezvous with our operative and assist in securing the needed intel. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> oh God! <laughs> One of our covert operatives was nearly successful in hacking a series of Exalt Com relays when enemy forces moved into the area. If we're going to have any chance of recovering that data, we'll need Strike One to provide protection while the operative finishes hacking the remaining arrays. If we lose the operative, we won't be able to recover the intel. We have a new objective. New position confirmed. Affirmative, Commander. Still nothing on TV. And we're in a cable company, from what I understand. 
if I'm looking, if I'm understanding that label, or that logo on the on the building correctly. So I run a TV company. Why, you know, why can't we watch TV? Rolling out. Heading to that location. All right, here we go. Orders confirmed. On the move. We hold still. <laughs> See them with my sniper. Let's see. How about now? Since I blew up their cover wall. How about now? No? I heard me running into more of them when I, once I get outside. Headed there now. Enemies spotted. Told you. Hi guys! <laughs> Seventy-six, eighty-three, seventy-seven, sixty-three, and eighty-three. Fire at him. <laughs> <laughs> I still can't see enemies. Aye, aye. Kill. Understood. Moving out. Sixty. Sixty four. Sixty two. Fire at him, please. Missed. Oh, shot wide. Hunker down, please. Let's do this. Moving out. Frag out. Probably taken by surprise. Oh, there's a wall there anyway. Affirmative, moving out. I don't know why the camera did that. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, they got hollow targeting on him now. Incoming over here. Just made a big mistake. <laughs> Taken care of. ET's trying to crawl trying to flank us. It's advantages. is for. Okay, they got they got some good hits. Okay. Target eliminated. 
a good music to just die to. <laughs> Fifty percent, huh? Going there now. How about now? Blow him away. <laughs> no longer a threat. I would hope not. That's the one you see right there. And, uh, I, I didn't mention it earlier, but yeah, but no, they didn't upgrade their weapons, so this is pretty much going to be one-sided. I think they are all dead. Heading to that location. You come outside. Will do. All right, it's clear. Moving out. I don't know why the camera's doing that. So. Oh, I'm supposed to go for this one anyway. Moving to position. We have an operative in position to begin the hack, Commander. We just have to activate the relay to acquire the data. Well, if it, if the cursor will let me get on it, I will. Our operative decrypted some of the Exalt data and temporarily disrupted their communications. That ought to slow them down. Now we just need to find and hack the remaining relays. Roger that. And it's going to be a turn of using a pistol. If I know the next move, they're gonna drop in here on this on this street and on top of this building on their next move. Understood. Moving out. Okay, catch up to here. Everyone to guard mode. Additional contacts are inbound on Strike One's current position, Commander. Got him. He's down. Damn it. Missed the target. Two of them appear on the street. Yes, I know you missed. So, they got us cover. Not enough ammo. Oh, just. Oh, okay, I get it. Oh, he's dead anyway. I'm going to need ammo soon. Sniper, back up. Alright, where's the other relay? Way back over there. Let's do this. Okay. Engaging jet boots. Moving out. Go ahead and patch him up. Don't move, you'll be fine. Go 
going there now. Moving to designated position. I had nothing. Hmm. Headed there now. All right, got you covered here. Move blue distance. I'm on it, Commander. And reload your weapon. Reloading weapons. Target confirmed. On our way. Standing on the edge. Got it. Moving. Running. Set him up, knock him down. Roger, Dodger. Good right there, and Overwatch. And now it's your turn. Running. Still nothing. Affirmative, moving out. You're protected up here, so... I don't know where they're gonna drop in, but you're protected. Solid copy. Moving to position. Here. Affirmative. I only have a feeling where I think they're going to appear. Position confirmed. But they're not going to survive. We've got another group of hostiles moving in, Commander. That's a load of bull. One got by you. Can you try again? That's the last of the relays, Commander. We've got Exalt's data. Now we just need to get the operative to the evac zone. Objectives updated. Nailed him. <laughs> she got double tap. Stay right there. My sniper will go ahead and move back here. Double time. Will do. Zang will start coming back also. I understand. Moving. Yep, there was no enemy contact, so sprint away. Rolling out. Is watching the evac point. He's gonna stay there. Understood. Moving out. Zeng is gonna be watching from the ground. Time to motor. Start running back. No enemy contact.
Sprint away. Rolling out. Heading up. On the move. Now he'll start moving. Affirmative. Moving out. And you're standing out in the open. On task. Guards out there. Good copy, moving on target. Beautiful shot, even though it didn't die. That's a beautiful camera shot. Another one. Seven more. He's probably radio. He's probably radio wing saying, "Oh my God, <laughs> I just got shot." <laughs> There it is. <laughs> oh, that was beautiful. Shot him and did a backflip off the roof. No longer a threat. He's dead. One more turn and it's over. Stepping off. On my way. One more turn and it's over. Heading there now. Yes, sir. <laughs> it's over. On my way. Commander, you've secured the operative and the new data they were able to acquire from the relays. Well done. I just hope the engineering crew can live up to the standards set by our troops after a mission like that. You already done that already. Panic produced by one in Germany got 100 credits. Intel decrypted. Possible exalt base locations narrowed. Oops, sorry about that. Five more days for the improved arc thrower. Four laser rifles. Get. How much would it cost to make a laser rifle?
14 credits. There you go. You know, with that, you know, giving them weapons, you know, giving them uh, advanced weaponry, it should have lowered their panic level by at least by, I would say, one. And then that would be that would be a fair gesture. Say, like, I mean, they, they, they just came to me and said, "Hey, you know, uh, can you give us some laser rifles to give out to our military?" This thing? is central. I'm receiving you. What do you mean you think you saw a snake? What the hell does that have to do with anything? <laughs> I don't know what that was about. Uh, I, I guess I have to look at that later. Uh, but yeah, I mean, it should have lowered it by one if you're giving out weapons. Fusion Lance. Fusion Lance is the most powerful anti-aircraft weapon currently available to XCOM. It should be capable of taking you down any UFO engaged by the Firestorm. Okay. Go ahead and research that then. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Well, that just makes the Firestorm cheaper. A little bit cheaper, anyway. How many? How many? One, two, three, four, five. I have five bases. And how much are the? Uh, Fusion Lance, it's 57 credits. So we're just gonna build one for now. 14 days. And build me a fu uh, Fusion Lance also. Okay, in the foundry, what can I do in here? Thinking about giving the Archangel armor to my uh, sniper, but I need to get advanced flight also. So we'll wait. The improved Arc Thrower project is complete. Waiting for more, at least one more thing to happen. The Brazilian government is asking for, uh, so they want four laser rifles to get 290 credits. So I'm spending 56, I'm getting back 200, uh, two, over 200. But yeah, they want laser rifles, I give them laser rifles. Alright. We'll do advanced flight now. I'll make sure production begins immediately. And as soon as we've got something, I'll be in touch. How much will it cost to make the armor? Archangel armor is 152 credits. Take a bit of money. Tough for what I have right now. Contact detected. All right, we got a small, small scout. Raven one. Take it out. Bangs out.
guess I'm only going to be having two people with the advanced arc throwers whenever I go assault the alien base. Touching down. Get ready to deploy. Our AO is within the continental United States. The bogey came down hard in a remote area just outside of a small town. We should deploy and eliminate any hostiles at the crash site. Why is it always a small town? You know, why can't it say it's like, uh, this this ship crashed you know, just outside outside San Francisco or L.A. or Las Vegas? <laughs> Loud and clear, Big Sky. We'll monitor those readings from here. Strike One is authorized to assault the alien craft. All right. I don't see the melt generators. That's the wall. That's affirmative. See anything? No, I see smoke. On my way. Yeah, just for a measure. That's affirmative. That's another thing I can do. I can get a, uh, definitely upgrade out. my guy's sidearms now. Confirmed. High cover and enemy's armor. Eight percent. Why is that one worse? Oops. This one is finished. Oh well, he got it anyway. I mean, that's good. Thirty-eight percent. Red's firing. Did eight. <laughs> oh, look at that. He got neutralized. He's impaled on the tree. <laughs> he was impaled on the tree. Alright, it says the mill generator was this way. 
Moving out. Alien object located. All right, good. Go grab it. Four turns. Double time. I guess they disappear. I'm guessing the other mail generator is inside their ship. I'm on it, Commander. It just got hot in here. Deal with us then, man. I'm on the move. It just got hot in here. Canister in tow. I'll tear apart your cover. Heading out. I know that guy definitely can. Hostiles Commander, pacified. the operation was a success. Well, that was a very small craft, so... Well, that very small craft is a small craft. Raven 1 is ready. I'm guessing they took a hit. No, rearmed. I figured the aliens would put up more of a fight. They didn't look so tough this time around. <laughs> okay, um... I guess I could have been doing this for, for the while. Okay, all I have are the eyes. Let's see, confers 20 will when defending. Second heart. I'll have the selected volunteer sent to surgical prep immediately. Once the genetic modification is complete, I will notify you directly. Get legs as well. Excellent. We'll begin prepping the candidate for surgery immediately. I will notify you when the genetic modification process is completed. There are sympathy. Adrenal neuro neurosympathy and adaptive bone marrow. Thank you, Commander. I'll have the volunteer prepped and ready for surgery shortly. I'll send word when the procedure is complete. Six days. Commander, we have multiple reports of new abductions in progress. The locations are marked on the Hologlobe. Guadalajara, new sniper captain, or four scientists. Let's go with the four scientists. All right, we're gonna bring some of the members from Team B here. B team. All right. Um, let's take out you two. Oh, that was McKenzie. Oops. I want y'all two in it.
me see. Um, diesel is the heavy. What else do we need here? Um, we need a support. Alright, we got Scarecrow. Yeah, her aim's 100, so... I'm not too concerned about their abilities. And we got Viking, he's using the plasma rifle. Speaking of which, I have some money now, don't I? We're going. Well, I have some money. Let's go visit the gray market right quick. Sell some of their bodies. Oh yeah, I got some damage stuff. some of these Ninety-four to produce that. One hundred and sixteen. Okay. Um, how many people are going on the mission? I may make them uh, light plasma rifles. How many people are using rifles? Uh, one. So I just need to build one. A heavy plasma and maybe a uh, um, another plasma sniper rifle. And oops, I was actually supposed to end the episode after the um, after the small alien craft. Oops. So, oh well. So this is this is just bonus. Give me another light plasma rifle. Okay, I can have one or the other, I can't have both. Give me the sniper rifle. So after after the alien abduction mission, it's going to be the end of the episode. This is just a bonus. <laughs> I, I was meant. I. That's my fault. So, here's a little extra treat for you guys if you're going on another mission with the majority of the B team. I'm leaving these two guys in it just in case they get, they get into a. Uh, uh, in case they get into trouble. Right, they're having the modified. So she has a light plasma rifle. I'm upgrading weapons. She has a plasma sniper rifle, and they have light plasma rifles. Target site is near the German border. Panic is spreading throughout a major city as the aliens move through the streets. We have to get a handle on this situation. Well, 
Let's get a handle on it. Let's... Central, Big Sky in position on approach of the abduction site. Strike one is awaiting drop clearance. Copy that, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage hostile targets. Watch your backs out there, people. I'm on it, Commander. Here they come. Kill the sectoids, please. Sectoids are dead. Here's my assault. That'd be you, won't it? I don't know how far up you have to be to see. On my way. Turn fire. Missed. Hostile targets moving to withdraw. <laughs> she set the car on fire. Yeah, disable him. This won't feel too good. Moving to firing position. Moving to designated position. Wow, you still can't see him. He has to run back to reload. Double time. Gotta stay in the back. Okay. Sniper. Got something over here. Next status, yellow. Didn't like that, did you? And you see the cyber disk. Take him out. Oh yeah. I'm on it, Commander. Location confirmed. That's a load of bull. Hostiles are pulling back. 
They're moving to flank me. <laughs> All right. Affirmative. This is your chance for a kill here. And you blew it. Missed. All right. Let's see if I can get somebody else up here that can do it. Aye, aye, Commander. All right. This is your chance, even though she's standing out in the open. Did four. <laughs> Just falls over. Okay, there's more aliens out here. There's one of the metal generators. Even damage also. Okay. Can I heal you from here? Yep. Copy that. That's what we're looking for. Ain't turned, huh? Did you grab that one? Wow, where's the other one? Heading to that location. Kill. Move up here. Stepping off. Target acquired. There you are, mutons. They're shifting their attack. Uh, I can't see you anymore. I'm guessing they see you. Yep, they see you. We need to change that. Heading to that location. Yeah, he went down. Mm. That all you got? This will not be tolerated. On the move. Missing the target does not help me. That's affirmative.
Location confirmed. Okay. Heading to that location. Initiating close quarters system. Two turns. On the move. Alien object in sight. Shoot first. No damage on selected target. Grenade right here. I didn't think about bringing a med kit. other one. I think I may have found it. Yep, I found it. Save the captain. <laughs> All right, I think that is going to start wrapping it up for this episode here. Gravely wounded for a week. I'm not surprised. Still, gravely wounds suck. Anyway. Panic has increased across North America because I didn't go to Mexico. War scientists. Germany decreased by two. Be in touch, Commander. So, Mexico, it went back up to three. Alright, nobody got promoted. Um, what's happening? Alright, you guys. The next episode, uh, if all goes according to plan. We are going to assault the uh, ex uh, Exalt base first, and then we are going to take out the alien base. These next two episodes are going to be really, really exciting. So, 
uh, keep tuning in to watch and see what happens. Uh, but guys, until then, you keep gaming out there. This is Commander Boomer signing out. Thanks for watching this episode of XCOM Enemy Within. If you like this video, click on that like button. It really helps us grow the channel. For more videos like this and more from the MultiplayerGamers.com community, click on subscribe. We upload new videos regularly. We also invite you to our gaming community at MultiplayerGamers.com. We'd love to have you join us. Until next time, this is Funarf. Thanks for joining us.